My next guest played Uncle Jesse on the TV show Full House. Now you can see him each week on ER. Please welcome John Stamos. You know, I want to talk to you about something. This Uncle this, Jesse thing. This so, thing, yeah. yeah I, you've been coming on the show for a number of years. Yeah. Every time I announce you, the Uncle Jesse mania grows. This thing, this, it grows in intensity. It's crazy. I don't it? quite know how to explain it. because the, the You know, it's been, it's been so long. And you know, I, but I've changed my hairdo over the years. You... <laughs> This doesn't. Uh, this doesn't no. change. This yeah. is like carved out of mahogany. I'm know, like, it's, a, it's like a, a whole like new a generation. Yeah. yeah. My niece called me the other day. My ki- my nieces are now starting to watch the show. She said, uh, "Uncle Johnny, you're in bed with a pig." Yeah. And I'm like, "You got cameras in my house?" Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she was watching. You know. Well, well, this is what I want to ask you about. I know that you get together because I, Bob, uh, Mr. Saget has been here several times. Uh, yes. He and I, I get along well with him. And yes. he, whenever he's on the show, there's uh, a, a full house mania. Like right. the the people in the crowd go crazy. Do you two get together? Still, do you do you guys hang out together? <laughs> How do you mean? Um, I mean, do you get yes, together? together. Um, no. I didn't do that. You did something with your. No, no, I did this. Right. This is the universal symbol for get, get together, together and watch football. Right. What you did was a little yeah, different. This. So. No, we do. Yeah. Well, last time I saw him, he like pinned me down and his locked me in his house and made me watch him on your show. Really? Yeah. <laughs> that's such a weird form of narcissism. Yeah. Yeah, 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 that's weird. very strange. But he talks about me in his act all the time, too. It's, you know, it's a little, I mean, I think he's, you know, obsessed with me. He's obsessed bit. with you. <laughs> As we are, you know, there was a period of time where I was obsessed with you. Let's You're, talk about this. I we missed had, that. We you, had, you, you, you remember when he used to, stay most? Well, I, 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 what happened was, for there was a period there right. where I was very angry with you. I was dating uh, Estelle Getty, right? Yes. Yeah. When you and Rebecca Romaine's were, were together, and she was Rebecca Romaine Stamos, I thought that she and I should be together, and I, I unfairly took it out on you when yeah. I used to scream, Stamos to the heavens! Stamos to the heavens! <laughs> what the hell was that? You know, I, Did you have what, these kind yeah, of problems no. on Full House where suddenly audio would echo for no reason? <laughs> yeah. Um, no, when, when I go places, people used to scream, stay in and I, I miss it. You don't, uh, I, need, you, I need to start dating somebody that, you know, would drive you cuckoo. <laughs> <laughs> Who would that be? Uh, just about any woman. Really? <laughs> now, are you, let's talk about ER for a second, because... <laughs> that this, would be good. <laughs> what? <laughs> to talk about the new show? Oh, thank you. Uh, <laughs> I'm glad you approve of my question order. <laughs> I wouldn't want to anger you in any way, <laughs> Mr. Stamos. I've noticed. This is a good. This job. has been like a broken interview yeah, from the a... beginning, but it has its own charm. Oh, I find no, it's, it's, it's good. a good show. Uh, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Again, I appreciate your approval. Uh, <laughs> really on ER, is... yes, they're yeah. constantly manipulating you. I've noticed into like sort of sexy outfits and situations. Is that fair to say? I mean, and, and in fairness, we can, we can contrast that with how uh, I am on television. I've never manipulated by producers or anyone into any sort of revealing outfit. Nobody wants to see that. But you constantly, is this not true? Yeah, they're always trying to get me wet somehow on that show. Like, like you know, like... Uh... I mean, it's very smart writing. It's, you know, you know, some of the finest acting on television mm-hmm. from this great, you know, cast. But, yeah, it's like, how can we get stamos? You know, the sprinklers are breaking or it's raining. Or I did a shower scene. It's just like water. Yes, yeah. I did a shower scene. Have you ever done a shower scene? Yeah, I've done a shower scene. Yeah. Yeah. I've been shocked you didn't see it. I didn't. I had to do it. It was in day. Porky's Five. It was <laughs> unbelievable. I had to do one the other day, and they bring out this, this like, uh, you know, midget thong. Can you say midget? I just did. Uh, little, <laughs> little people's thong, and you have to wear this little kind of very tight, you know, skin-colored, uh, flesh-colored uh, thong. thong. Yeah, small thong. It was yeah, I don't, yeah. very small. Very, no, it wasn't big. Yeah, <laughs> it was a tuck and run. You got to. I don't know. It doesn't. So, uh, so I did. So we've done that. 
This show so, has gone to hell in a yeah. basket, hasn't it? So they like you. They like you covered in water no, no. and like pretty much naked on the show. And you're often operating uh, on people when you're naked. Yeah, no, 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 no. Can I be of any help? Yeah. Put some clothes on. <laughs> Why? I do wear gloves, though. Have you ever tried putting on those gloves? That's the hardest part. The hardest part of ER Everybody is putting on gloves? Medical stuff. I brought some gloves so you can try it. Because you got to put gloves on like very fast in like 10 seconds. What if I pull a rubber out? That would have been a joke, right? <laughs> you, have to, you, have to, you have to put the gloves... Can you, do you know any medical terms? I mean, like you have to give complicated medical speeches yeah. while putting on gloves? Is that hard? No, why, yeah, try it. And go. Action. Well, clearly we have to give this patient some hypothorazine. We have to actually administer it right now. We have to make sure that, like, we have to have it, and make sure that they crack the sternum right there, and then we'll... <laughs> I'm ready to operate. Yeah. Now, You're right, that is, that is impossible. Now take off your clothes, and uh, <laughs> we'll throw some water on you. This isn't your fantasy night. <laughs> now, Conan! <laughs> so, uh, this is fantastic, though. It's very nice of you to, to you. stop by and, yeah, and see us. You've been on the show for so long, and you've been very supportive, and I, I touched my leg it. for the fifth time. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what's going on there, but you've got something to work out. Uh, <laughs> ER... <laughs> ER airs Thursday at 10. <laughs> airs Thursdays at 10 on NBC. John, thanks a lot for being thanks, here. Yeah, yeah, there it is. We'll be right back. Nigella Lawson's on the show. Stick around. <laughs>